Well, the fork loops are installed, the engine runs, oil's been changed, shocks are cleaned and painted, ready to go on. I just got to put them on still. So what I'm down to is the sprockets in the chain. And put an air filter back on it. But the whole ordeal with the shocks, man, I don't know what in the hell somebody was thinking. It's pretty crazy. On these particular swing arms, there's a spacer post right here where your shock is supposed to ride right here, like this. But apparently, whoever had the bike before me thought their shock went over it like this. Like this. Oops. They thought it went on there like that. So that's how they were. But that is actually to center the damn shock. That's what keeps the shock center parallel with itself. So, yeah. They freaking ruined a decent set of shocks. I don't know why they busted out both ends. Probably so they could flip them upside down, I'm guessing. But they're not very good shocks. They're kind of weak. But anyway, that's it. And I got the exhaust all painted up. The exhaust looks a lot nicer than it did all rust orange. I ain't making this bike perfect, but I'm making it usable. It'll be a dependable rider. And it won't even look half bad. But yeah, that's it. Just putting them shocks on and changing out that freaking sprocket. I already got it soaking. That chain adjuster right there is going to need to be cleaned up bad. It's real nasty. I might even have to replace that one. I've got another set though. So. That is what it is. She'll be running here real soon. Once I get it running and after I've ridden it a couple times, I'll go ahead and paint that engine. So, uh, Saturday looks real doable, man. Real doable. Not much. Not much left at all. Well, I'm out. I'm going to get back to work. 